Hello children. Today we are going to learn a new chapter in civics, chapter 5, Women Change the World. Let's know about this chapter. In this chapter, we will look at work outside the home and understand how some occupations are seen to be suitable for men than for women. Types of efforts made by the women's movement to challenge discrimination in more recent years. Opportunities and rigid expectations. The reason they this is because they feel that outside the home to women are good at only certain jobs. For example, many people believe that women make better nurses because they are more patient and gentle. This is linked to women's roles within the family. Similarly, it is believed that science requires a technical mind and girls and women are not capable of dealing with technical things. Types. Engine drivers are men, but 27-year-old Lakshmi Lakra from a poor tribal family in Jharkhand has begun to change things. She is the first woman engine driver for Northern Railways. It is important to understand that we live in a society in which all children face pressures from the world around them. Sometimes these come in the form of demands from adults. At other times, they can just be because of unfair teasing by our own friends. For change, in the 19th century, many new ideas about education and learning emerged. Schools became more common and communities that had never learned reading and writing started sending their children to school. But there was a lot of opposition to educating girls even then. Yet many women and men made efforts to open schools for girls. Women struggled to learn, read and write. Let us read about the experience of Rash Sundari Devi, the date from 1800 to 1890, who was born in West Bengal some 200 years ago. At the age of 60, she wrote her autobiography in Bangla. Her book titled Amar Jiban is the first woman First known autobiography written by an Indian woman. Rokhya Shakhawat Hussein was born into a rich family who owned a lot of land. Rokhya learned to read and write Bangla and English with the support of her elder brother and an elder sister. She went on to become a writer. She wrote a remarkable story titled Sultan's Dream. For this session, define stereotypes. Why the girls do not get the same support to study that boys get? Third, give reasons. Women were not seen as porters. Fourth, read it is read. It's difficult for us to imagine that school and learning could be seen as out of bounds. A. What do you understand by out of bounds? B. What was the attitude of the people towards school and learning in the past? C. How does it change today? Topics of this lesson will be continued in video 2. Thank you children.